Okay, I should be streaming now. I'm not gonna be able to look at ooh. figuring out how to oops, that's not that's not the window I'm looking for. Maybe I should just take that out and and just make it so that that window is on the screen already. Over here. Make this a little smaller. This a little dinner. Make this whole thing larger. There we go. Now I will be able to read the chat. I will, well, let me know how the audio is and if you can hear the chill beats and um, I guess I'm gonna get started. Oh God, I don't remember how to Photoshop. Does anybody, anybody remember how Photoshop works? Cause I certainly don't. It's mostly just me. Okay, I'll turn up the chill beats a bit. Screenception. Hey, Rach. <laughs> um, all right. Tell me if the if the chill beats are slightly more audible now. Nice. Thank you. Yeah, I know Photoshop. I know how Photoshop works. I say, having just said, how does Photoshop work? So today we're gonna be doing some art drawing and I'm gonna work on patron requests right now I have a request from my good patron uh, Andy and I'm going to look over her instructions well except Bolt you're here so I'll do yours first because you're here in the chat right now um, let me get, hold on, gotta get the reference you sent me. I sent it to the iPad. That's not where it needs to go. That's not where it needs to go. It needs to go to the computer. There we go. Airdrop. Airdrop. I know how. I know how airdrop. This is not a professional art stream ball. It's human. It's, it's rage. That's not... They've changed, see, this is, I'm going to draw the kids, got that good ref. You're not on blast, this is very good art. It's been so long since I've photoshopped. I don't know anything. Hook is very good. No, I don't want, I just want to browse through them, please. 
Kyle, Ultimate Pencil Hard sounds good. <laughs> that, okay, that looks good. That looks like a nice pencil. All right. Oh, God, they've changed all of the hot, somehow they've changed, Photoshop has changed all of the key binds. I don't know who Kyle is, but apparently I downloaded one of his brushes so, at some point. Oh, this is, the music got so loud on, in my ears. The stream is just gonna be me floundering and then also just jamming. So, oh my god, these kids. They're gonna be doing cute shit, cause that's what, that's what it's all about. Art good. New Photoshop bad, but art good. Nope. There we go. A better ear. Oh, why did I decide to do this from this side of his face? Where it's way harder to make a nice swoop to the hair because the part is obscured. Why have I done this? It's fine. I don't know, this, this, this uh, lo-fi, it's supposed to be lo-fi video game beats. They're not so lo-fi necessarily right this second. Good. Hi, Horby. <laughs> what? Hi, <laughs> what? Bleep. <laughs> Bleep. It's true, I do have vocal cords and I use them. This music is not what I put, I didn't come here for this. Okay, I came, I came here for the chill video game beats. There we go, that's better. Mm, too big. I have... I don't have that many apps open. I just have a lot of apps in my... Um, in my... What? The thing down at the bottom of the screen. It's gonna drive me crazy that I can't remember that word. I have Discord and Messages and Spotify. And then Photoshop and OBS and uh, AstroPad, because that's what I need for streaming. No, this is dubstep. What is this? Please. Don't make me just go to DJ Cutman's uh, Spotify, because I will. Taskbar, toolbar. Program Dungeon is very good.
Yeah, Program Dungeon is the canon name now. I don't make the rules. He's got that good, good, good beard. Look at this good hawk. What a good man. I know nothing about Hawk because I have not played DA2. I mean, I vaguely know because he was in Inquisition. No. Rach, honestly, how dare they? I have to change his eyebrow because he looks too cocky and I want him to look soft. That's better. Too big. I know how the brush tool works. Good Lord, Photoshop, stop telling me how brush tools work. I use a brush tool every day of my life. I know more than you, Photoshop. That sounds like so much, Bolt. Hmm? Why is this hair just keep... Technical camera, oh no. Why does this hair just keep becoming cloud strafe hair? How much, how, how much have I done? No, I don't want, mm, there we go. Oh my God, stop telling me what the brush tool does. Now I accidentally selected white instead of black. Welcome to Scout tries to remember how, this is, I want, this. welcome to Scout remembers how to use Photoshop. She's been using Procreate for 17,000 years. Photoshop, I swear to God, if you tell me what the brush tool is, one more gosh dang time. Thank you for the, oh, my water is across the room. Oh my God, my dog is on the couch and she's so cute. I just saw her over there, she's so cute. Hi, Sam. I haven't used Photoshop in so long because I just used Procreate. Welcome to the stream. Oh my God. Please. Lord. Where's the girl? There's the girl. Small. 
small and tall. Thank you all for coming to watch me uh, draw art. It's very exciting. Big eyebrows, yes. I just noticed how big eyebrows she has. I live for them bigs. This is the first stream I've done in a long time. Uh, I just today figured out what the issue, I was having an issue with OBS and screen capture for like six months. Um, and I finally fixed it. Bull, is her hair up or is her hair short? Oh, got it. Thank you. Like bun? Like bun like ponytail? Oh, yeah, hell yeah. God, I love Sheik. What? Well, how could you, how dare you bring up Sheik at a time like this? Because now I'll just talk about Sheik for the whole stream. Nope, that ear's not right. I love Sheik so much. I love Princess Zelda and Ocarina of Time Zelda is an icon and she deserves the world and she's so sad and she did one, she, she fucked up one time when she was a wee babe and her whole world suffered for it and she doesn't deserve that. And Sheik is dope, and and she's the genderqueer icon that we deserve. Just like that cardinal. <laughs> That's what she's got to do. Photoshop. I'm going to yeet Photoshop into the sun. You can't keep telling me what the brush tool does every time I select it. You can't do this. What is, is B the keybind for brush? I'm just, and E is for eraser? Yeah, I'm gonna use the keybinds. I'll make her eye go, she's looking up more eventually. God, Photoshop. Thank you, Bolt. I'm gonna try and turn off tooltips. Y'all gonna see this. Oh God, there's so many, oh, there's so many options. Tools. Show tool tips, thank you, God.
I'm using a I, I'm using AstroPad to get this up on my iPad. So it's basically just a mirror of the screen. Photoshop is dumb a lot of time. A lot of the time, it's true. But also, I'm d I just haven't used it in a really long time. I was gonna try and get Procreate, uh, like get a, do it the opposite way and get a mirror of my iPad screen up and then use Procreate, but I couldn't remember how to do that, so I did this because I remembered how to do this. <laughs> Friend of the stream, Zelda the dog, barking at what? What are you barking at? Oh, the UPS man is here. It's okay. I don't think he's bringing anything for me. No. Hopefully you can hear me slapping on her like a bongo drum that she is. She is a very good bongo drum. E. Pat the dog. Gotta pat that dog. A little bit of colors. Okay, let's see if I can remember how to color. In Photoshop. Your cat must scream. Billy, hello. Billy wants to say hi. Hard round pressure size, sure. Mm. Love, love to use the the the, the thing Photoshop with all the brushes that I definitely remember. Hi, Billy. Billy's a good boy. Excuse me? Oh, I'm on the eraser tool. It would help if I wasn't. It, was it would help if I was on the brush tool. There we go, this needs to be bigger. This isn't the right, I selected a different tool. How, there. There we go. Mm I well, you know this about me that I want to play Breath of the Wild every day of my life, all the time, at all times, every day. 
500 plus hours already logged into the Breath of the Wild? Whatever, I'm gonna play it again. I love Zelda games. Oh, color on my screen is different from color on this screen up here, which is what's being broadcast, so that's great. Yeah, like a... Streamers don't interact. What tool is this? Smudge is what I want. Oh god, that's so big. Excuse me. I just want a little bit... I just want... Smudge that a little bit. Get that nice blend. So pink up here. My workflow is agonizingly slow right now. I apologize to my viewers. What is the shortcut for... I? Need to get a nice brown in there. Dark brown. A bit more red. I haven't heard of my time at Porsche. What is that? What's that, Blip? Drawing is good. So I think that's a that's a valid procrast procrastinating from playing games by drawing is the opposite of what most art most artists do. <laughs> Post apocalyptic stardew sounds so way too sad for me. I play, I play a game like Stardew because I want to just have a nice time. I forgot that pressing Alt while you have the brush key is also the eyedropper tool. Thanks to my muscle memory for bringing that one back out. Sam, you're so nice to want to draw my boy. Birthday presents and commissions are both very good too. I love the drawing you did of Altair, Sam. 
He's a good boy and you, you, you did him a justice. You did him a, a good justice. Oh, Miyazaki Esk is good, that's right. Miyazaki Esk, very good. What chat? Chat, what's, uh, what's your favorite uh, Studio Ghibli film? Mine is Howl's Moving Castle because I'm predictable. Uh, and also, it's really good. Sorry, that was so aggressive. Don't tell me my Apple Pencil battery is low. Don't do that to me right now. Getting some good, these are some good takes. Kiki's Delivery Service, Princess Mononoke are both very good. You're learning, you're evolving, just like the AI. The beat's gonna, the beat's gonna drop in, in this track that we're listening to right now. <laughs> I can't believe this. be using the smudge tool as much as I am but it's lit here in the stream we got that that dubstep remix of Song of Storms shine in his beard too. A good man, he deserves a little shine in his beard. He's got a nice shiny beard. Maybe not. That's a lot of that's a lot of shine. Hmm. No, I'm gonna stick with it. He got those nice Edward Elric gold eyes. Double down, Guardian. Shax is here in the chat with us. Hot Destiny reference. I'm working so slowly for me. I've been reminded why I use basically exclusively AstroPad at this point. Some of it could be Animal Crossing music, Sam. It's just a general Spotify playlist of lo-fi uh, video game music remixes. I like to listen to it when I'm working. What do y'all want to see in Animal Crossing Switch? Um, I just want to see, I want to see more, like this is kind of a small thing, but more koalas would be nice. I really like the koalas. Uh, 
Um, honestly, they could just port new leaf to the to the switch and like they don't even have to make a new one they could just put new leaf on the switch and i would still play like 300 hours of it so it just, really the bar is very low for me rach you minx you minx rach Oh, bug friends would be very good. I hope that the uh, the mailman who just came can hear me speaking to y'all and think that I'm just talking to myself very loudly. Give us the gorals, you're right. Excuse me, excuse me to Danny, my, my very nice shy mailman. Do you want to come and be on the stream? No, he's gone. I can see him across the street. He's walking off. Yo, mailman on stream win. Welcome to my charity stream. If I if I make a thousand dollars in this stream, I will get my mailman to be on the stream with me. I want the E. I want that eraser. Brush. Get that. He doesn't, Sam, he doesn't deserve this. He's so tired. He has to deliver so much mail. You want to see, let me, let me draw my, draw you guys my mailman real quick. Big, first of all, make this smaller. Big hat. Big hat. Got that big mailman hat. With like. Boop, 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 you know. BME. Like a little bit of, and got glasses. Ooh. He's tired. He looks so he looks so sad in this picture, but he's really just tired all the time. <laughs> laugh, laugh at the laugh at the sad mailman. Sad safari mailman. And he's got, of course, like the skinny little mailman neck. You know how mailmen have those? You know how mailmen have those skinny necks? Just weighed down by mail and the weight of the world. That's fine. That's no.
Yeah, tired and existentially tired. There he is. He also has, you know, y'all know how mailmen have those shorts and then like the really tall, it's very, Rach, <laughs> Rach, I live in Los Angeles. He's already in a place that's sunny with an ocean. He's already here. He mailed himself here already and he's just still, still tired. Anyways, y'all ever see mailmen? And they have like, I'm trying to figure out the best, you know how they got like those big shorts? And then their legs, but like then the really long socks. This is, this is what all male men here look like. Smaller, I'm just, sorry, I'm catching up on the chat. It's just smaller, smaller male men. It's really doing it for me. Bye. Bible. A high sassiest lass. Uh, eat, eat that good food. Um, currently, I'm working on patron sketches, but took a break to um, draw my mailman because that happened. He was here. Oh, I, I just realized I did him on the same layer as the color, so I have to move him. Don't worry, he's still here. He just had to be moved. You gotta always have the small mailman with the regular mailman. Oh my God. Sam, I'm losing my mind. Um, I have to color Rosanna. She yeah, got that nice dark complexion. Oh yeah. That's no, that's no, what did I do? That was weird. Okay. Deep down, the the real treasure was the mailman was in us all along. And that's really just what, what it's all about. The UPS truck of our, of our hearts, absolutely. We are all also existentially tired. We are millennials. There's no escaping existential exhaustion as a millennial in 2019, the seventh year of Luigi. We're all, aren't we, what is a Gen X 
or Gen Z person except a millennial that's slightly older or younger. Oregon Trail generation isn't very good. I think Bolt is, um, she'll, tell, she'll tell me later that I'm calling her out on this stream, but I think she's technically Gen Z, which is wild. brief break to do some stretches always stretch at your desk artists and anybody who works at a desk really stretch <laughs> that's it that's the uh, that's that's my head cannon here have a girlfriend. <laughs> oh no, save him. He doesn't get paid enough for this. No mailman does. No, that's too... Mm. No. Give Mailboy a girlfriend, 2K19. Do it. Would it just be... Another, another hat, of course. Girl, but male. Makeup on an envelope is so much worse than the cute lady that I'm drawing right now. With big shorts. All male, why do all male men, all male people have them big shorts and them real tall socks? Tiny foot. They just re they just regular socks. I mean, unless they're like super armored socks, that would be very cool. See, this male woman is, she has all the confidence that that this boy does not. <laughs> tiny mailman has a tiny male woman girlfriend. She 
she has a letter for him. Letter says, I love you. That's it. It's very, it's not economical to write two words on the letter. But she did it. Come over here. Come eat, come eat your boyfriend. Oh, you're too big. Here, you have to be slightly smaller. To hang out with your boyfriend, the tiny mailman. Nope, nope, that's wrong. Too big. Now, now she's too small. It's the the three bears, the Goldilocks and three bears up in here. The girlfriend is too big. This girlfriend is too small. This girlfriend's just right. them. Move them slightly closer to other mailman. Get yourself a big <laughs> mailman girlfriend. You know how it be. I love how this is shaping up this whole thing. Like <laughs> just zooming out. And seeing the little margin doodles happening makes me so unbelievably happy. This is a good stream. This is the this is the quality blessed content. That's a pretty good. Mm. Having such a hard time getting the blush color that I want. There we go. Where where were you when the mailman got a girlfriend? Green? Green. Green. I'm looking at the ref on my phone now, if you were wondering. Her eyes be like that nice blue-green. Her hair is very close in color to his, but a little bit lighter. One more red. Yeah. Hey, well, welcome back. You missed the historic event that Tiny Mailman got a tiny male woman girlfriend. It was very, it was very important. One, some might say it was uh, the most culturally significant thing to happen so far in 2019.
He deserves it, honestly. Sometimes I'm just that powerful, Sam. I'm starting to I'm starting to remember how Photoshop works. The longest patron sketch in history. That's, that's not what I wanted, I'm sorry. There we go. The Photoshop knowledge is coming back to me. No, I don't want to delete, I want to make new, thank you. should they have behind them? I mean, when in doubt, teal. Whoops. That's too teal is the thing, but I can fix it. Teal is just really good. There's no, there's no other color like it. I welcome to the stream where I just play with curves. In Photoshop. I want to add more red to the kids. Uh, more red on the bottom. More bottom red. A little red, less little red. No, wait. That's good. This is not this. This pink is not quite right. Soft light. Oh. I'm just gonna go with the pink for now, and then I'm gonna fix it. It'll probably end up being yellow because that's what works best for rim lighting.
Hit, hit me, hit me up with that question. If you die in D&D, do you die in real life? Well, in, I don't think physically no. Well, Bolt says yes. I think it's a little more complicated than that. I don't think you physically die in real life, but I think mentally and emotionally you do because I couldn't, I couldn't deal with losing any of my D&D characters. I love them all far too much. And so I would die. I would become a husk of my former self, probably. All right, let's see if I can fix this so that it looks good. The closest I've come is familiars that I can re-summon at any time dying, and that was already emotionally difficult. Enjoy me very quietly, but determinedly looking for exactly the right blend mode to make this rim lighting look the way I want it to. I think soft light's the way to go. Cat, how dare? There you go, there's my, all right, here's what I'm gonna do with this. That's not right. Wanna alpha lock it? No one. I guess probably just using No, multiply. Yeah, multiply looks the best. But maybe just go a little bit. 
Yeah. Yeah, it looks nice. Good lord, it took me so long to do this. I'm so slow. I'm so slow in Photoshop. this whole time. I'm so used to auto-saving. Um, well, Feb. Hmm? Jan? Yeah, I didn't do one for you for January yet, well. Sixty-six point nine percent. Nice. Nice. It's all done. Let me get you. Rice is good. Get a nice crop in there. I'm gonna leave the male people. I have the male, do you want the male people in? Okay, they're still, all right. Sheesh, okay, okay. I'm gonna put them in a more thematically appropriate, and by thematically appropriate, I mean, I mean, a male baby. What would a male baby look like? I'll put them down here. I didn't like that they were just kind of at a weird, in a weird spot. Oh, don't, well, how could you, how could you do this? Oh God, there they are. Unbelievable. I, for one, am disgusted. Save it as that nice JPEG because JPEG colors look better. Don't need that. No, I don't want to crop it. There you go. Save your PSD like that. All right, gang. What should we do now? After the stream, I'll send that uh, file along to you, Bolt. What should I do now? We can always talk about our feelings. Currently, my feelings are overwhelming love of the Zelda franchise because of this music. Oh, Sam. Y'all are. Mm. How dare. <laughs> oh, cookies sound really good, and Sam's said a very nice thing. Y 
Uh, Sam, did you not know that Rach is actually telekinetic? I'm so, so one of my other patron requests this month is just really good names. Uh, Trinket is somebody that, that I've done multiple times. Uh, Telekinetic Astronaut is uh, actually my new video game idea. Uh, so Trinket is a kobold cleric, and I guess she is becoming an item with another uh, of the PCs in her party named Calvin Beans and Calvin Beans is such a good name and I can't stop thinking about it. Shalfon Surprise is one of the one of um, the friends that Bolt and I play Destiny with. Uh, <laughs> Trinket did catch a good one. Had one of one of our friends that we play Destiny with. He had a character named Shalfon Surprise, which is the best name I've ever heard. I think. Yeah, everybody please tell me about your D&D characters. That's a very good... Bolt out here with the good ideas in the chat, because I will always talk about D&D characters. And I love it, and I love hearing about everybody else's. No, that's so sad, Sam! Oh, I don't have the right. Still valid, definitely. That sucks, though. Is it the good? Is it the good boy? It, it, oh, I do know about your. I do know about yours, Rach. I love Leaf the hungry Tabaxi. Sam, that is the worst. I hate that feeling. DM, how dare. Hmm, interesting. Sounds fake, sounds fake, but okay. DM that continues to disappear. that I've done a trinket before. Does she have ears? Smutty Dragon Age Magnetic Poetry is very, very good.
scrolling through my own photos. <laughs> Blip, I'm so sad. Blip! How could I do this to you? How could I do this? I've betrayed you and I didn't even know it. Why do I draw so much? It becomes so difficult for me to find my own artwork. There she is, there's Trinket. She doesn't have ears, she has horns. Talk about all of the D&D characters. I love that boy. Him good, him good boy. That's my, that's my input on this. I love, I don't know what's happening over here, but I'm, I'm very for it. Oh yes, yes. Right, yes, yes. These are the kinds of these are the kinds of commissions I want. Rach out here giving me them good commish. Oh my god. Rach, this is such a mood. Blep, I also, I also thought that. I thought it was the poetry. Lannister look like? I don't, I have never seen um, that one. Okay, okay, it's the, it's, it's Dinklage, Peter Dinklage, Peter Dinklage, okay. What was the other touch touchstone?
Chris Evans was another one of the touchstones, so probably more like Dinklage, Peter Dinklage, Peter Dinklage. I love Peter Dinklage. Oh, shit. Gang, my Apple Pencil is dead. So I have to, mm, what do you guys want to, what do you guys want to do for a few minutes while my uh, Apple Pencil charges? This always happens to me. F in the chat for the pencil. That's very good. While it's charging, I'm actually going to mute my mic and take a bio break real quick and I'll be right back. And let's keep talking about good stuff like D&D characters in the chat. I expect more D&D &D info when I come back. Are those boobs? How? It, blep. How could you do, how could you do this? Oh, infinites. Where, which one's mine? Here I am. How back me be? Um, Warlockter is very good. <laughs> Going back and looking at the chat. Boobs is very important. But that's very good. Let's see how. Don't open, no, don't do this. Don't open iTunes just because I plugged the iPad in. Apple, don't quit. Y'all can see what I'm gonna be listening to. Sam and Blep are now at uh, 
they're up from C rank to B rank in their I am generally a mm. Mac mm. Hmm. Mac tends to do some not great things. Um, but I generally am a um, I like my Mac products. I think that they're just about as frustrating as any other kind of product, if not less frustrating than like a PC. But uh, iTunes has just gotten so bad. iTunes bad. His head's too big is the problem now. I can't believe that we've got Warlock of Frankenstein in here. Oh, that rules, Sam. I have a character who makes plant golems. Love that shit. One potato. Just transform. That's really cool, Sam. It reminds me a little bit of um, the... It's like if you took the... I think it's Celestial Warlock, which is kind of like cleric -y Warlock, um, but made it more like a nature domain cleric. It can mix all of them together, which is really cool. I want more smoke. Please let me move. 
please let me move it. Thank you. Warlocks are, I, I believe, still my favorite class to play. Um, I love Altair so much, and I love my monk Timaeus too, but I would also love to go back and play Altair again. Arms of Hadar, so good. You know what else good? Eldritch Blast. Eldritch Blast, really broken. Very broken, but in a way that I appreciate. Like, because if you take that, if you take, if you take that, uh, that invocation that gives you um, the ability to add your charisma modifier to Eldritch Blast, that gets fucking bananas. That just adds probably between an extra three or an extra five. Uh, I know that Altair, uh, at the end of that campaign, we were level nine, I think, and Altair was doing so much damage with Eldritch Blast, like that it was all I ever did. Because you have two, as a warlock, you have two spell slots, basically. And then you have Eldritch Blast to sort of counteract that. Absolutely, 100% Sam. Oh, did I run out of... All right. I think I'm going to wrap up for the moment because I think my dog is, is getting antsy and wants to go outside and play for a bit. And also, my Apple Pencil needs to charge. Um, but I love these characters. I love all these characters so much. I must save the pup. Yeah, this has been super fun. I'm definitely going to do this again and try and do it more often. Um, I'm really happy that I figured out how to make it not look like garbage, which was the thing that was mainly uh, keeping me at bay for the last however many months. Um, I'm Hopefully I'll get back to my Nuzlocke that I was doing too. I had a silver Nuzlocke going sometime last year, so maybe I'll get back into that too now that I'm figuring out streaming a little bit. Uh, Alright, thanks everybody for coming. You're gonna see into the infinite for a moment as I turn off the stream. Uh, it's been, it's been super fun. Bye gang, thank you!